We really wanted to get away from that idea that kids, everyone had a different thing that they were eating. This person didn't eat this, and this person didn't eat this, and you know, someone wanted chicken nuggets all the time. So really, I mean, part of our philosophy is that everyone should be eating out of the common pot. I think uh, much of our um, history and uh, philosophy of cooking has a lot to do with my father, who was born in Russia and always wanted to be a farmer. And then grandma would go then and use a lot of his ingredients, the right, cucumbers and, and the cook. zucchini and the tomatoes, and she would incorporate that yeah. into whatever she was. So we were sort of eating so local before we even knew that that was a I trendy see. thing right. to do. I mean, recipes really filled with vegetables and whole grains and beans and low in processed right. foods and additives. We all make this amazing, we call it the pollen signature salad dressing and cheese and fresh fruit yeah, in it. Fruit. And it's so delicious and it's like the most popular thing that every time we get invited to anybody's house, that's what they want us to bring very often. It's the potluck. And they always yeah. ask, what's, yeah. can I have your salad? Yeah. Yes. No. Yes. My favorite dish is called cod in Thai broth. Uh, I love fish. My husband is not a fish eater. And if I can make the fish and drown it in a spicy <laughs> sauce, then he loves it. You're you're really teaching your children about how to behave in the world. You're teaching them, first of all, how to fend for themselves, how to cook, they're comfortable in the kitchen. You sort of can almost train your kids to crave what's healthy, like to eat what's healthy, if you make it taste good. And if everybody is eating it, sometimes that's more appealing to kids, that they want to be eating what the grown-ups are eating. And you're also really cultivating family traditions. I mean, I think if your kids are seeing you cook and creating these family meals, then they're going to pass that to the next generation. Which is what happened with us. Yes, and yes exactly. exactly. Yeah. A lot of people are afraid to cook. They're afraid of the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And we want to say anybody can do it. 